have a little uh, what I call nursery area. Uh, this is a Davis uh, variety of Ace Vesinosa. Um And uh, just to, to my amazement, I was walking by and noticed a little kind of crunching on the leaves here. And then, I don't know if you can see this little guy. And then down in here, um, there was actually another one that I spotted. I don't know where he's gotten off to. Then there's some crunching over here. And this is uh, just it's one area. Oh, there's a bigger one. Can you see him? And this isn't even uh, the main flower bed. So I've got at least four in here. Uh, it's pretty exciting. And I think this is a little safer spot for them than uh, down in the regular flower area. So, okay, this is our main uh, patch of showy milkweed. There's a little bit of uh, tropical blended in just for color. Um, and some Davis in here also. You can see it's a little the leaves are a little uh, bluer. Oh, there she is. She's been here for, what, almost two weeks now. Hard to get a photo, a uh, video of her because she just flitters around so much. But she's still laying eggs. And uh, we've got a bunch of leaves that are starting to show up, uh, being munched on. It's hard to, to really see if it shows up on the video. I'm not really looking for any of the caterpillars uh, over here. You know, when they get bigger, that's fine. If they make it, that's uh, awesome. But um, it's a dense... Uh, well, there's a nice munched area there. But it's very dense. Um, they've got enough food to last them, and when they, any that make it over in this patch, uh, we've got other flowers uh, that they can eat off of, get some uh, nectar before they take off and go north. But I mean, it's um, it's just amazing that here they are in Crow, Oregon. I just can't believe it. Okay, just wanted to show you the main patch. Later.